What's up, you all? This is Barry Barnes, a &R Report, and i um, just here to talk to you about a, a subject right now. I'm about to give you my good Obama speech right now, and I hope that you listen closely, especially all you artists out there who are running amok right now, just doing whatever, running around the whole United States, and just actually not paying your bills. That's what this segment is called right here. It's just a, a little informational that I'm going to be giving you artists out here on things that you should know and that you should be doing as well as just a little bit of logic from the world of bonds on when I'm looking at you guys just you know doing your thing out here in, in, in the music industry but this one right here goes out to all of my administration people um, all you managers consultants um, engineers DJs producers uh, whoever, songwriters, whatever, you know, we got some grievances with you artists. The grievances are that you guys don't pay your bills. Like, this is ridiculous. I'm looking at all these rappers out here. I mean, they're just talking about all this money that they have, you know, going to strip clubs, making it rain. Like, come on, dude, are you serious? It's like the government is shut down, man. And you up here making it rain? I mean, come on. Like, it's really crazy. Like, I sit back and sue Ronnie Vu sometimes or whatever, and I'm watching, you know, rapper A or rapper B spend his whole advance money throwing it up at some whack-ass stripper. Like, yo, and, I, and I'm sure that they probably have open-end bills with producers that they probably haven't paid. Like, really, producers, for real, you guys are better than me because I get my check ASAP. You know what I'm saying? Either those that I consult, yeah, I need my money today. You know what I'm saying? Or else I don't do no work. You know, it ain't going to be no back end, nothing, okay? So, you rappers, man, it's like you guys would rather pay Fendi, Gucci, Louie, and China Black at the fucking strip club before you pay your songwriter, before you pay any studio time, or you pay your producer. You know what I'm saying? It makes no sense. Like, you guys really need to get your minds together right now, like... Pay the people that help you win first and then do all of that flossing. Like that flossing, let's be really, man. That flossing is nothing but just some insecure, childish bullshit that we do as men or women just to impress women. And it's really whack. Like you guys really need to get your heads together. Like I roll with a click of cats that's not going to take no back end checks. Yo, we need to see that up front. So you need to, you do need to get your minds in order and really start paying all your bills ahead of time instead of being delinquent. Because seriously, those tracks can get repo. You know? Like I, I, I it just doesn't make any sense. I'm seeing dudes spend all type of ice, you know, buying on rent and leasing all type of cars just for the look. No, we're about to look second, man. Make sure that you got your foundation, which is your records. Get your records produced. Pay that producer. Okay? It keeps all the relationships good. Alright? So you won't be sitting here because for real I'm going to have a coalition to get these producers to put you guys on blast. And I know a couple that will put you guys on blast. But that's my Obama speech for the day. Just want to let you guys know that I am consulting. If you need someone to run your campaign, holler at me. HustleMGMT at gmail.com. 646-712-3002. I want to give a big shout out to my man, Senator Skid, my homie in this as well. Uh, yo, get at me. Hustle management. Positive minds move forward.